to learn fast, you need constraints. So what is the main thing you need to focus on when learning machine learning? Training models and evaluating them properly. This is the only thing that matters. So you need to push everything else out of the way so that you focus on that. Um, don't have the hardware you're dreaming of, doesn't matter. See how far you can get in this uh, Kaggle competition using just Kaggle notebooks. You know, instead of investing the time into researching what hardware to get or, you know, figuring out how to use cloud VMs, if you're just starting out, your focus needs to be on where you can get the quickest improvement for a um, minute of your time expensed. And that is training models. What other things, what other constraints can you set on yourself so that you clean the space to focus on what matters? Well, uh, maybe you're thinking which framework would be best to use. Uh, research it for, you know, time box it. Give two hours to that research or maybe four hours if you want to be super thorough and that's it, stop. From there on, you're not second guessing yourself. You're not in this constant loop of uh, figuring out and trying to uh, establish which framework would work better in your situation. Uh, jump into that framework and uh, learn it to some level of proficiency. And w why is this so important? Again, to maximize how fast you're learning, how quickly you can get to good results. And then as you become more advanced data science practitioner, you will find that switching frameworks is, becomes na natural to you. It is very quick. And essentially, it's not the framework, it's the concepts that you use that give you true power that give you your model true predictive power. So focus on what's important. Use constraints to push what is uh, in a, unessential out of the picture. What are other things that we can push out? Another big thing that people sink a lot of time into is picking the right MOOC for them. The shortcut, find a person who's doing what you like to be doing and see which courses they took. Um, and stop fretting over this. You know, instead of spending five weeks on researching which course to take and, you know, testing the waters, give yourself a day uh, or two to do the research and invest the time where it matters. And where it matters is doing the course and learning. And you will find that even if the course that you pick is not perfect, you know, the value is in moving forward, in, uh, in accumulating the concepts, in accumulating the knowledge. And, you know, you can't go wrong. You can't go terribly wrong with a popular course. All right. Um, so how am I applying this to growing this channel? Well, what is the most important thing to uh, becoming a good communicator on video? Outputting those videos, you know, having as much time on camera as you can. And in order to do that, I have to uh, push away uh, all the considerations that are slowing me down. And that is, what hardware do I use? Uh, that is the biggest one that uh, YouTubers uh, spend a lot of uh, time and money on, uh, where it initially doesn't matter because the essence is the value that it can give to your viewers and how comfortable you feel on camera. I want to maximize that. So I'm setting myself a challenge that I will not buy a single piece of hardware until this channel reaches 2000 subscribers. Either I can pull it off or not, we'll see. But you know, uh, this way I will be doing what matters. I will grow my skills as a communicator. I will think about uh, what you guys want to hear or more uh, precisely, how I can add more value to my audience, how I can share my experience best. This is where my time needs to go right now. So I'm setting this constraint, I'm setting this challenge, and I will show you the equipment that I'm using. You know, I literally have a uh, Dell USB dongle that uh, connects to my laptop, uh, that came with my laptop, USB-C dongle, and uh, I plugged in a, <laughs> a USB um, sound card into it, and I have a microphone that's plugging into that. You know, when I connected this apparatus, when I assembled it all together, I didn't even think that, you know, it would be working. I mean, a USB sound card working with a phone, but it works. And I'm sticking to this uh, setup for as long as it takes me to reach 2000 subscribers. I'm not getting anything else. Okay, so better get used to seeing my face like it is uh, because uh, 
that's what will be happening on this channel. Uh, only uh, video and audio of this quality and uh, the best, absolutely the best insights uh, based on my experience that I will be sharing with you guys. That I can uh, promise you, this is something that I'm uh, giving my entire attention to. Okay, thanks so much. Uh, like and subscribe for more. See you soon.